welcome to aminacademy.com in fluid mechanics let us discuss about pressure variation in fluid at rest look at this figure here the pressure at any point in a fluid at rest suppose this is a some fluid element is here the pressure at any point in a fluid at rest is obtained by the hydrostatic law which states that the rate of increase of pressure in a vertically downward direction must be equal to the specific weight of the fluid at that point now first we'll write that law hydrostatic law the rate of increase the rate of increase of pressure in a vertically downward vertically downward direction must be equal to the equal to the specific weight weight of the fluid at that point means suppose a, a small body is immersed here in a liquid of given specific gravity so it exert a pressure that means the body is exerted pressure by use by the liquid which is how much distance from the free surface and the pressure varies that means if you go deep and deep more deeper in the liquid we feel more pressure we can feel this in suppose in swimming pool we are going deep and the deeper or in sea level you are going deep in sea we feel more pressure because that uh, rate of increase of pressure is vertically downward a, in a dire, in direct must be downward direction must be equal to the specific weight of the fluid at that point suppose if more specific weight we feel more pressure as well as how deep you are going that much pressure increase we feel now we'll uh, more discuss about this here consider a small fluid element small element as shown in figure let delta a is cross sectional cross sectional area of element yeah this is a abcd is a small element the cross sectional area is delta a and delta z height of the fluid height of fluid fluid element P 
equal pressure on the face AB. Pressure on the face AB. Here, face AB is here, pressure is P. Now, Z equal distance of fluid. Distance of fluid element from free surface. Here, this is from here to here, Z. The forces acting on the fluid elements are the forces acting on the element are here this is a fluid element the forces downward force upward force right side and left side forces we consider first is pressure on AB pressure on AB is that is pressure force force on AB equal pressure into that small area delta A cross sectional area acting downward and second pressure force on CD pressure force on CD it is upward is uh, equal P plus dou P by partial derivative dou P by dou Z and delta A it is upward by using Bernoulli's equation we are using this one and third weight of fluid element weight of fluid element is we know that density of the liquid gravity g and volume here we can write this one density is rho gravity is g and delta a into delta z fourth cross sectional area into thickness delta z now fourth one pressure force it is acting downward pressure force forces on surface on surface BC and surface on surface surfaces BC and AD means right side and left side are equal and opposite means here this forces
these forces are that one equal and opposite for equilibrium of fluid element consider equilibrium of fluid element given fluid element we have that means rho rho delta a is upward or downward here rho plus this P delta A here P delta A rho rho plus do is do P by do Z into delta Z into area delta A plus rho G delta A delta Z equal to 0 upward downward right and left that right and left is balanced so therefore we have P delta A minus rho delta A multiplying with rho delta A minus dou P by dou Z delta Z delta A plus rho G delta A delta Z equal to 0. Now we have dou P by dou Z dou p by dou z dz by da that means we are uh, keeping this friend and the rest of the things we are writing here rho g delta a delta z this cut here then or further dou p by dou z equal rho g delta a delta z by delta a delta z therefore we have dou p by dou z equal rho g which is equal w weight of the where weight density of the fluid where W equal to weight density of fluid. Here, this equation 1. So, equation 1 states that rate of increase, the rate of rate of increase increase that is dou p by dou z increase of pressure in a vertical vertical direction in a vertical direction is equal to equal to weight density weight density of fluid of the fluid fluid at that point that point therefore integrating one in 
integrating one that is dou p dou p equal that is dp equal integral rho g rho g rho g dz dou z become dz because we are integrating therefore integrating p p equal rho g z where p is the pressure above atmospheric this is the where here p equal pressure pressure above atmospheric above atmospheric pressure and z equal height of the point that is datum height of the point from free surface therefore that equation therefore the equation 2 becomes we can write this as z equal p by rho g also you can write therefore z equal called pressure head z equal pressure head we have done. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.